snowed for the very first time. We're still in our pajamas. So one of our squirrels, a baby. a baby, got stuck in a box and then died. Because it's too cold. Because he got so cold. <laughs> That's what I said. Please. All right, you guys, we just shot our Q&A video and it was super fun. Did you have fun, Gabby? Spicy meat! I think that means, yeah, she did have fun. We're just having lunch. It's 11 o'clock. It, it was short? It, it felt short, but it's 22 minutes long. But after I edit it, it'll be like 10 minutes long. Anyway, we are, it's 11 o'clock. We're headed to the barn as soon as we're done lunch because we have a special surprise for Sabrina. And that special surprise is gonna come in handy considering that there's a bunch of snow out there. Looks like it's starting to melt though. Try not to flinch challenge. Did you flinch? <laughs> oh wait, <laughs> they probably didn't. And just like that, the snow is mostly gone. Oh, God, we found some on the trampoline over there. Our yard looks such a mess in the fall. Looks all bare and just messy and gross. Come on. Guys, he's our friend, our neighbor, and, and our animal, friend. our animal support person, right? He always finds us all the injured animals. Do you want to say hi or no? Hi. Can I name the church? We were headed to the horse barn, and then our neighbor who finds all the injured animals, like literally, she doesn't know what to do with them, but she finds them, and she called us and said, "Hey, there's an injured squirrel, baby squirrel." So, of course, we went running, and of course, in her house just down the street. Yeah, and of course Gabby caught it because she's so good I at that. I have a <laughs> Anyway, so we're gonna try and take care of him. We're gonna see what he needs, assess him, and if we can't help him, we're gonna take him someplace where we know that can help him. Okay. I'm probably gonna scream. Don't scream because you're just gonna scare him. Just be patient. <clears throat> Let's stick this box in here. It's over on the other corner. Okay, I see him. Okay, pull the box. Okay. All right, I'm really sorry, guy. He's injured. Let me, where's the it's peg? okay. We're going to give you food and water mom? until we figure out what's wrong. You're okay. We should cover him up so he doesn't get freaked out. Yeah. Good idea. You are like an animal girl. Let's go get a blanket. I'm an animal whisperer. I still haven't figured out which leg is all right, so which leg? It's okay, it's okay. Just be calm. I know it's a scary situation for oh. you. So I saw some blood on him. A little. Oh my goodness, he is just the cutest little thing. Oh my god, I'm keeping him. You guys said hashtag get Gabby a bunny. Hashtag get Gabby a squirrel pet. Right, but this is a wild squirrel, and we can't keep him. We have to keep him until he gets healthy. All right. Well, I don't know what's wrong with him. Hey, bud. I love squirrels that have that little short face. He's got a short face. It's okay. Let's go get him a blanket. 
Oh, he's going to the bathroom. He's like, I'm afraid of you guys. I'm just a baby, you know. I oh, know, you guys, it's so mean. It's really hard to rescue an animal. All right, so we're gonna move him to a safer spot that he feels safe. We're gonna cover him up so he feels like he's in his own den, give him some food and water, and then we're gonna go to the barn, and then when we get back, we will figure out what to do with this little guy. Hashtag, I got a squirrel pet. No. Hashtag, this is God's wild animal, and he doesn't belong to us to play with. Oh, he's like gonna be really careful. We're overwhelming to him. All right, let me go get some stuff. Well, isn't that a fine mess? Thank you, Snow. You gonna go get her? It's super windy, you guys, so you probably won't be able to hear this, but Somebody asked me and she comes by name and she saw us and we called her and she just stared us down but I think she does know her name. I don't belong in the desert I've never longed for someone's hand But when you came straight from nowhere One minute I over there we saw the world from the same perspective though i was there to breathe again and i went straight for what you wanted through the desert there and back again whenever you having a little bit of grass on her way up because I have to wait. One of the little girls that live here came and Gabby went back to um, help her catch her horse. And so while we were waiting, Sabrina actually asked me so nice, hey, could I have some grass? And I was like, yeah, of course you can have some grass. Hopefully it doesn't backfire because her and food seem to not be a good combination. I think letting her have some grass. It's yummy, huh? She's like, don't take me away. I'm so hungry. So we bought Sabrina a nice purple blanket. The only problem with it is that they didn't have her size. They didn't have any sizes for Sabrina in the whole store in winter blankets. So, in turnout blankets. <coughs> Hear that? I know what, I know what a turnout blanket is. Anyways, um, so we had to buy the next size up and we have to try it on her and hopefully it fits. Never longed for someone's hand But when you came straight from nowhere One minute I was over there We saw the world from the same perspective Though I was there to breathe again And I went straight for what you wanted Through the desert there and back again all right, you guys, what do you think? Is it too big? Yeah, it looks a little big. All right, you guys, we need your honest opinion. I wish you could tell this right now, but um, do you think it's too big? It's a little long at the back, I think. These straps loosen, these. But I think we're gonna Go keep on. it. You guys think it's okay? Yeah. You think it's okay? <laughs> Three, two, one, left. Molly, I think it's okay as long as it doesn't stop her from moving properly. What do you think Sabrina? She's like I'm unimpressed get this thing off of me. What do you think of your new blanket? I think she looks really good. I think she looks pretty in it too. You're gonna be the cool girl in the paddock now <laughs> Well, we're gonna layer it like This one is gonna go over top of another blanket for when it's really cold. So maybe a little bit big will be okay. 
so this is the saddle that I ride in and I love it. It's a 16 inch and I probably need a bit bigger, but isn't it the nicest saddle? I love it. The girls that we ride with on the weekends, they ride Western on the weekend, and so it makes the girls want to ride Western on the weekend. And well, I want to learn Western. And I feel like she's a little happier than when she first got here. She's definitely more calm again. Poor Sophia. Did we decide Gabby is going to ride first? Yeah. How do you feel? Everybody yeah, wants to know. She has to ride for a short time, and I got to ride for a long time. How do you feel being having to share a horse? Mad. Mad? Would you rather not have a horse and not share it, or would you rather have a horse and share it? Share it, but then I'd have to ride it first. You like time. to ride first all the time? Are you just happy to have a horse? Yeah, me too. So are you guys jumping? You're going to try a little cross rail? But no, are you going to try a little cross rail? No. Are you doing gymnastics on the horse? Molly, did you see me canter? You doing you gymnastics on the horse? You canter? Good job, Sophia. What did you canter on? Jasmine. Now Gabby's riding like a girl. <laughs> Side saddle. What we decided about join up was that at Sabrina's age and temperament, she really doesn't need it, even though it is a really awesome way to join up with your horse and connect with your horse. I just feel like at her age and at this point, we could do some other things that maybe suit us better and suit her better to bond with her. So we're not gonna do join up. But if a time ever came that we had a younger horse, a horse that maybe needed a little bit more of a connection, then I think that we would definitely try it. But I think we're just not gonna do it with Sabrina, at least not right now. There goes Sophia. There's a storm coming And I need a hand to hold With the fear of being here on my own With the winds blowing And the leaves they turn to gold 
I did it with you those summers ago She's all dressed in purple. What do you guys think? I think if it's okay. I think it's a little big. It's a little big, but it's gonna have to do. It's the only size we can get. And I'm gonna get another one that's gonna go underneath it, like a barn sheet. As you and Sabrina's jealous of my carrot. Well, yeah. <laughs> Sophie, why didn't you ride her down? I wanna ride her. Well, Sophie hasn't had a chance yet. You wanna ride her? Okay, this is how you share a horse. One rides her down and one walks her down. What do you think of the color we picked? Do you think purple's good? I picked the color purple. And she looks pretty, I Very like it. We'll be able to tell which one she is in the field now, but I bet you that blanket doesn't stay pretty and clean for long. There she goes, she's like, I need a drink. Oh, she doesn't like the mud. You want to spend a little bit of time with her? All right, so since we're down at the barn, the girls decided to clean Sabrina's stall. It's not too bad, huh?